there's the musician's lounge. This is where we keep our parts. Um, let me check this folder really quick. Yeah, I'm going to bring this with. And then here we are heading to stage. I'm Jay Ritchie. I'm the assistant principal timpanist and section percussionist of the Detroit Symphony. And we are here in beautiful Orchestra Hall. Backstage area with lots of sound and light equipment. Signatures from everybody that ever played here. And the stage itself. I was first inspired to play percussion just by a friend who had a drum set and I thought it was really cool, which I think is a lot of kids' entry into percussion. Um, but I was fortunate to start studying with a teacher who taught me all the variety of instruments from the outset. And um, I don't know, I was just hooked. It was the feeling of that first sixth grade band concert when suddenly you're part of this larger whole and it's an amazing coming together experience and, and you just, you, you kind of get chills with the sense of being part of this beautiful thing that's greater than the sum of its parts. I think it's very important to have that exposure at an early age because the earlier you experience it, the more able you are to, to get good at it quickly, but also the more apt you are to have it become part of your soul and personality. I do a variety of um, education programs here at the DSO, including um, Grow Up Great classroom visits with really young preschoolers, um, all the way up to our, our best civic ensembles and master classes with the percussionists there. With the Bucket Bam project, it's, it's a fun way for the kids to um, get this experience of performing and in some, in some cases when they're doing halftime shows at Little Caesars, it's a huge crowd. What they don't even realize is that they're learning musical fundamentals, but at this age, they're not really being taught them in a, in a direct way, but through learning their routines, they're learning rhythmic placement, they're learning coordination, they do lots of stick twirls and things and they're having a blast. And so hopefully it inspires them to think of music and music classes as fun. There are sometimes moments in a lesson or a master class where you realize a kid just had a light bulb moment and they see it too. To see them expand their brains that way is just a really special thing. There is no culture that doesn't have its own music. And so when you understand another music, you're getting a window, I'd like to think, into those people's soul and, and their own view on the world. So it sort of establishes empathy in a way. I, I really believe that a culture, a society, a community has its soul expressed through music. And if we're going to have a great society here in America and Michigan and Detroit, then we need great music education because that is an important source of expression and inspiration for every member of our community. And through our education efforts, we make sure that we're reaching children and they will be part of our DSO family and, and hopefully the community will be better for it.